Hey everyone, it's Heather here and welcome to my channel. Um, so, um, it's been a long time since I filmed my last uh, video. I've been very busy uh, with my projects. But now I'm planning a trip. It will be a 10-day trip. And I thought I, I would like to share with you um, the items I take with me. So, um, during my trips I try to stick to my everyday aesthetics concept, uh, to my minimalist uh, lifestyle as well. So, let's take a look what I take with me and why. Now, uh, I will not uh, talk about the documents and the passport and money. Um, so we know, uh, we all know we should take these items, but I would rather talk about um, clothing and uh, cosmetics and self-care products and uh, also um, gadgets. Now, I plan to only take a hand luggage with me, uh, simply because uh, it's a 10-day trip, so I don't want to be overwhelmed with uh, the things uh, I take with me, so let it be as minimalist and aesthetics as possible. Uh, now, there are different terms as, as for uh, different airlines. So, uh, in my case, this time they allow only 5 kilos of hand luggage, and uh, it's uh, it's not that much actually. So last time it was uh, 10 kilograms, but uh, you know many people forget that hand luggage doesn't only mean uh, that bag you carry with you. It also means um, that you can take additionally your handbag, um, an umbrella, and other things, so it depends on a company, so I strongly advise that you read those terms, but my point is you are not restricted to only one bag, actually, so you can take some other small items with you as well. Now, let's take a look at the items I chose for uh, my trip, and let's start with uh, clothing. So, basically, I'm a fan of Mm, black and white colors currently and I also adore gray so gray is my go-to color this year um, I don't know why I love it so much but I do especially um, graphite um, gray so my uh, wardrobe basically consists of these colors so if you watched my um, video on 10 to 10 wardrobe challenge, you might know that uh, it is possible to create a very nice and uh, a very versatile wardrobe uh, picking the right, by picking the right items. So what I take with me, let's take a look. So it's spring, uh, the temperature will be about uh, 18 to 20 degrees. I'm planning to go to Georgia and uh, the first thing I will take with me is this um, gray oversized sweatshirt. I really adore how it feels, how it looks and it's so versatile for a casual look so definitely it goes with me and I also take a pair of um, cotton black leggings with me, so they they will make a great match. Now, the next thing I take is this <laughs> gray um, sweatshirt. Now, this is basically for lounging. I plan to wear it at home or in my hotel. So, uh, it's not oversized. Uh, it's pretty short as well, but if I feel like uh, I want to wear something warmer. Uh, this uh, sweatshirt is uh, the item I will choose. Plus, it's very lightweight, so it will not take much space in my hand luggage. Now, 
The next thing I take is uh, this cardigan. Um, it's by H&M. Uh, so let me show you the texture. I really love the color. Uh, and uh, it's also a very versatile thing. So you can wear it uh, on its own or if you feel uh, like um, it's um, getting colder, you can throw it on your t-shirt, on your dress and you will look pretty stylish yet you will feel cozy and warm. Now, um, I will take one dress with me. This is um, one of my favorite dresses. It can be worn as a casual outfit or uh, you can wear it for a night out. It depends, it's very versatile as well. And what I feel, and if I feel colder, I can pair it with this cardigan and uh, yeah, this how it goes this is how it goes okay and uh, I also will take a pair of um, black tights with me uh, to pair it with my dress now the next thing is this striped t-shirt it's oversized uh, and uh, it's by H&M and actually I bought it secondhand uh, for just one dollar. Can you imagine that? I really love how it looks, especially paired with my leggings or uh, black jeans. This time I will wear it with my leggings um, and uh, if I feel uh, cold, um, again I can pair it with this cardigan. So I think they look great together as well. Okay, and the final thing, oh, not the final, but one of the last items is this oversized black t-shirt. Now, it's uh, my go-to <laughs> t-shirt for casual outfits. Again, it goes great with leggings, with jeans, with skirts. This time uh, I will not take um, any skirt with me. It only will be leggings, as I mentioned. And uh, yeah, again, if I feel like it's getting colder, I can pair it with a cardigan. And uh, I really love this t-shirt. Now I'm wearing an oversized t-shirt as well. So I love to wear it at home. Um, it's very comfy, uh, it's easy to, you know, wear, so I will take it with me and I plan to wear it in my hotel room as well uh, when I am lounging there. And um, again, um, I would like to mention that of course I will take uh, some underwear, some socks and uh, something to sleep in. Now this is it for my items um, and uh, I think that I probably will take my trench with me but I'm not sure yet. I think that if uh, the weather is getting really warm I will not need it. Now let's talk about uh, my self-care items. Um, you know uh, I only have this small tiny bag this is where I keep my shampoo, my conditioner and my shampoo gel. I will also take my hand cream. I showed it to you uh, in one of my last videos. It's actually a Dermabee lotion. Um, of course, I will take um, some toothpaste. Uh, you know, it's almost empty, so I think I will uh, finish it during my uh, trip and uh, okay let me show you one more thing I'll be right back okay so actually I have three more items 
uh, this is a cleansing form. I think I also, I also showed it uh, to you in one of my previous videos. Anyways, I will take it with me. And it's almost empty as well, so I think I will finish it during my trip too. Uh, of course, I will take my crystal deodorant with me and uh, this um, soap box I have here. You know, um, I have a very gentle skin prone to irritation, so I only use uh, uh, Dove soap bars. And uh, I will take my soap bar with me. So I have this pretty <laughs> tiny soap box to put my soap into. So this is basically it. Of course, uh, I will take my hairbrush with me and my toothbrush. So I don't think I should like mention it. But all in all, these items will not take much space in my hand luggage, which I will show to you as well. And finally, devices. Now, uh, when it comes to devices, I will only take four of them. Of course, I will take my phone and my headphones with me, but additionally, I will take this power bank. So, uh, this is a really great thing to have. Uh, I bought it maybe uh, five or six years ago and still works great. And second, I will take my Kindle with me. So if you watched my videos on book reviews, you know that I was debating whether I want to buy Kindle or not. And uh, initially <laughs> I bought it. Um, I love to read a lot and I love to read uh, paper books. But um, when it comes to traveling, I think Kindle is very uh, convenient. It doesn't take much space. It's pretty lightweight. And uh, yeah, I prefer to take Kindle with me uh, during my trips. Now the bag. So you may wonder what my hand luggage looks like. Now I was debating about whether I want to have that uh, regular uh, luggage but I've opted for this bag so I've already traveled with this one this is a simple gym bag I've bought again about five to six years ago in H&M and it's pretty large uh, and uh, pretty comfy to use so yeah uh, let's take a look how, how it will look uh, with everything in it and how much will all the items weigh. So let me pack everything into it and we'll see. Okay, so I've just realized that I forgot to mention one more thing. This is my cosmetic bag, so I will take it with me as well. And if you want to know what's inside, you can watch my video where I showed everything uh, what I use, so I will link, leave a link to it in the description box below. So basically I've done packing and this is my bag and I've just weighted it and guess what, it's 2.9 kilos. Okay, and uh, the allowed uh, size is 5 kilos, so I have two kilos spare, so maybe I will take uh, some snacks with me, you know, I don't know, yeah, maybe some snacks so it won't be like uh, more than like th 300 grams or even half a kilo. So as you can see, uh, this time I'm traveling lightweight and uh, I'm really glad because um, by picking these items, I managed to, on the one hand, uh, stick to my everyday aesthetics and minimalistic lifestyle, and on the other hand, I saved on my luggage, and uh, I also don't have to wait for it upon arrival. So, yeah, this is basically it. 
So that was it for today. Thanks a lot for watching. Let me know in the comments below what do you think about my uh, items, my clothing items, self-care and uh, gadgets. Uh, do you think uh, I'm missing something? Uh, what do you usually take uh, with you during your short trips, like one week or like 10 to 12 days? Uh, what's your experience? What type of luggage you are taking? Uh, let me know in the comments below. Um, I will be really glad to know new ideas and um, new perceptions. And uh, yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.